Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, Miss Adventures with Mixed Media. And I am continuing to work on uh, my journal where I'll be using some Stamperia paper. And it'll be kind of like a wallet size phone. A little bigger than a phone. Probably will end up being 7x4 like the last one. But I was hoping to make it a little bit smaller. We'll see. Maybe it'll be 6 by 4 six and a half by 4 Just slightly smaller. So, in the last video I painted this and then after the camera went off of course you knew I had to go and smoosh and make more of a mess that's okay and so now it's fairly dry and I don't know what I want to do that's not gonna help me because that's gone but I feel like we should add some lightness to it somehow it's just, it just seems really dark so I'll start down here since it's Oops. Since I may or may not use that bit, I need to fill my. Ooh, I have a new gesso jar. I mean, not a new one. I brought mine from downstairs. I don't want to put it everywhere. Well, that's kind of what I want to do, right? Just. Just kind of random spots here and there. I don't want to do that. Maybe I don't want to use my finger all day either. Although I probably have a little bit. Well, no, I have no control. I can pretend I have more control with my finger, but we know I have no control. Not even over myself. So I'm taking off some of the white after I put it on there. Some of it I'll rub. Just want to add a little lightness here and there. And. You know, I want the splotchy, I want it to not be perfect, you know? That's the whole point. It's background. Other stuff will be over it, ideally. Um, so, yeah, do we think it's time to unify this with a stencil? And also some stamps. But first, a stencil. I should have picked out a stencil already. No, no, I didn't need that one. I did that one on the last one. Where's the blue one? I like the blue one. That one's one of my favorites. I realize that means I probably shouldn't use it all the time, but that one's not. Ow, my finger. I do a little bit of that, maybe? We'll see. Wait, I had, oh man, I purposefully left it out here so I would have it. But do you think it's here? No, because I moved it. Like, I moved everything. I moved a pile of stuff and it probably had one of the stencils I would have wanted to use. No. Ooh, maybe. I don't like those bits, though, so much. I don't like that that one's, I don't want a square one. Oh, that'll work. I think I used that on Rachel's, though. Yeah. Maybe. Dragonflies. I wonder how that would work. Hey, for all of you know, know I was looking for it, I found my squirrel. Squirrel! I found it, I found it, I found my squirrel. I will probably lose it again before I want to use it again. Because that's how I roll, apparently. Oh, this is the one. No, nope, not that one. That's the one I was thinking of. Because it's not quite as big as that one. Haven't figured out yet. I have an obsession, even if nobody else says, Ooh, that one might be good. I have an obsession with Janusk. Well, mermaid scales, not so much. Maybe some roses. Because then I can add a little bit of pink. That one's different than the one I did on Rachel. So that'd be at least not exactly the same. Ooh, that's fun. That might be fun. But I don't see Sarah as a Danisk kind of people. Or Chevron, really, for that matter. I don't know. Hey, I was able to find some stencils, though. 
Alright, that one's kind of square is the problem. But if I came in on the edges, it might work. Where's the one? Here's the roses. I want to come back with some roses. And I might need to... Um, I just want to do like one at a time. So, how I will figure that out is I will cover the two next to it so I don't get some tape here. Because I will only want one rose and I don't want all the other bits and bobs around it. So, I'm just going to take this. That's probably how I'll, I mean, I won't even need to take the tape off because knowing me, it's probably how I'd prefer to do it anyway for most things. We'll see. I don't know why Hello Darkness, my old friend, is stuck in my head now, but there's that. In case you didn't think I was weird enough. going to cover you and you. Now you'd think I could uh, do it without getting it over that but yeah that's not likely and I don't want it sticking so, so if you like one part of a stencil and you don't want it to go through just put some tape on it that's it. That's all you gotta do. I'm gonna put some roses and they might be pink. But a light pink, so almost white. Be doing the sponge sugar. Scattered the sponge sugar never shows. Do the tattered rose, see how that looks. See if it comes out at all. And if not, see if we're gonna do it here on the bottom. And See if it will show through. Now, I could do, yeah, see that one's not going to, but what I could do, what I could try, I should have known that wouldn't, we'll try that. If I use the Distress Oxide, there's a higher, that's more pigmented. That was never gonna. Anybody know where I had that rose in the first place? Can't even tell. Not a little bit I can. Yeah, even the leaves are gonna get to be pink. Because it's not even gonna hardly look pink. And you know what? I might just go on the spine with this. And yep, I'm gonna use my roller for a second. So if I do do it six and a half, then I want it at three. Well, one, two, three, and a quarter would be the middle part. can't even see if I'm straight anyway so we're gonna not do it straight on purpose if you like to have things perfectly aligned but you don't like to measure then just don't make them perfectly aligned mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. And I'm going to go the wrong way. Okay. There's that. 
Now, at what point should we do the stamping of things? Do you think we should do that before? Is it, I see, like I said, I have never been through a class to tell me how to do all this. I just, I just do it. And do it, and do it, and do it. I do want that one. Maybe that one. Definitely that one because I haven't used it in a while. Oh, that one. Because if I can't find my stencil, I can at least use my... That one's alright. Maybe I'll use it. Oh, this is one of my favorites. Even though it's not even a... It's not even a, um, what's the word I want? I want to use this. Seriously, words. I can't do words. Oh, it's not even officially a stamp. It's a makeup brush cleaner <laughs> that I got at the Dollar Tree. You can go check that out. Alright, so this one I'm going to do, I've got some cream. That will lighten up our background a little bit. Use, I've been using picket fence, but that's just so unpredictable. I'm not in love with the... Isn't that so cute? I just kind of like how it unifies things a little bit by having a stamp that you put all over. Looks like eyelashes. <laughs> It looks like <laughs> Okay. Now we got a little bit of lightness back there. So, now what I might do with this, I might add a little bit of darkness. So where's my chip sapphire? What do do? Ooh, I guess I'm strong today. Seriously, I just had it when I was looking for the cover for the other thing. I want my chip, my chip sapphire. It can't have... This is what happens. I had it, and now it's gone. Oh, seriously. Well, let's do this with a little bit of black. don't have that either. I mean, I do, but it's not great. Is this one going to be a little too bright? Oh, that one will be alright. Just get it all wet and wet. Oh, it stinks a little bit. Just kind of doesn't want to show anyway. So what's the point? No, it doesn't even show at all. No, but seriously, what happened to my chip sapphire? All right, what's next? This one probably won't show either because it's the same color as what's on there. And I'm afraid to pause again because the last time I paused, I left the video and so then that messed me up. Okay, right, who, oh, found it. 
Yay! Alright, let's move our roses out of the way. Alright. Oh. Let's keep that. I have two backgrounds that I love to use more than most anything, and that is a houndstooth and... You might have guessed it. A, um... Harlequin. Do not love how you get the straight line there, though, because that's not what I want. I wish this was a bigger stamp. That's what I wish. Try to line it up a little bit. Came out really wet there. There we go. And get that out of the way. And if I do this, so it will dry and not spread too much, just a little bit. Because the point is for it to be an aged look anyway, so. Now, when this wet bit touches the tattered rose on there it's going to affect it because that is because this is wet and that's a distress oxide all right do you know how hard it is to line up a especially when your paper moves there we go and we're blotting so it dries a little bit faster and there at the back so that's the the front bit right there and I can't remember I think she said I wish she had like at least said that like you know she liked the look of Rachel's or Becca's more like as far as if she liked the painted look or if she liked the collaged look. But no, Mike got nothing. She wouldn't even tell him his fa her favorite color, nothing. She was wearing turquoise um, fingernail polish or he wouldn't even, I wouldn't even know this direction to go. And I looked on her Facebook, all I got there is she likes food. <laughs> And wears bright colors, so. But I also know she wears, you know, what she can find, what's available. Alright. I know that's not going to match up perfectly, but at least. Then I think I want to come down here. Do this. Do it this way. And I would use the block, but I don't want it to be perfectly perfect the acrylic block when I say the block yeah those see that's clean <laughs> nothing else came off all right let's see so that make sure it's dry it looks wet even though it's not oh and this bugs me a little bit hold on don't like those lines of course the more I try to fix it the more I'll probably mess it up that's all right all right so we have our roses on our spine which I will reinforce the spine before I put my inside in, my inside papers in. And I will probably do a coat of, I'm not sure what, because I don't want to lose my flowers. I'm trying not to use a lot of the Distress Oxide or it just goes away. And I also don't want to use like paints that are just going to like, I mean, uh, not paints, inks that are just going to like smudge when I 
put like a polyurethane on it or whatever. All right, let's do, did I ever find the black? Oh, and this is missing a cover still. That's gonna annoy me. All right, can't, oh, I don't have the archival black, but I do have black sit here. That's ground espresso. I just use the, this, even though I may regret it later. Only because of the potential for the bleed through. I don't even know if it's upside down. I think I just did it upside down. Hmm. Oops. Oopsie. This, oh, I couldn't even tell you where this one came from. It might have been from one of the stamps my cousin gave me. Or it might have been, I can't remember, honestly, I can't. And I don't know why we all like the look of the, the words in the background so much, but we seem to like that, don't we? We, as in mixed media artists, I never thought of that in the first place. Anybody know? Has anyone ever done any research on that? And yes, I am overthinking this. This should not take this long. <laughs> Definitely should not. Somebody talking outside. I'm surprised I don't have my window open to my right. Well, I'm not not so surprised either because it's a little bit of a pain. All right, the exact words won't match up, but at least go. No matter where it is, there'll be some words. All right, I think that's enough for words. Oh, I want to keep that out for a minute. Now this I do want to use. It's hard to use it. I just had it. You know, I just found my stupid block. Here it is. This one I haven't been able to find. It was downstairs. It's got some words and some lace on it. And it was from one of my Bow Bunny kits. And it's probably not going to stick, but that's all right. It has a lace. No, I don't want any more. I think I want it to be black. Let's see. Hmm. Do I want it to be black? I might want it to be clean. Or something else that's not black anyway. Ooh, ooh, I know what I want it to be. I don't want cream either. I'm going to use... And because it's half a circle, I'm obsessed with putting it on where lines are, so... So I'll put it, like, on this side of the, what is that called? Spine. Barely shows. That's all right. It's not for fancy. It's just for interest. Oh, that's what I'm gonna show because I just put it on the same color. Hee hee hee. I think I'm keeping the top. Down there is probably not going to show. Maybe half of it. That's interesting. You can kind of see when it all touches down on this one anyway. Not on all of them. Of course I put it at an angle on this stupid thing so I'm like poking my fingers. I don't know if that one will show or not. This 
sound of silence. Do, 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 do. Now, do I know what I'm doing here? Because I still haven't found what I'm looking for. Alright, we have the roses on the side, which sadly may disappear. This is too long for here, too wide. Mm, not a ninja star. That one looks like a ninja star. This one's got like a square. Like I'm afraid it's kind of. But you know what I could do? I could just. And are we doing this one again? Oh no! I want. I know what I want. I know what I want. This is aspen mist. That's what I want. I still don't know if this is the stencil that I want though. Didn't I pick out stencils that I thought I wanted to use? Why do these not seem to be the ones I want to use? You know what? This is like the perfect size for here. Kind of, let's see. That's where's the middle. That's around the middle right there. We'll just do this, and I think the edges are wide enough. What colors on this? Looks like some brownish. I really need to like get enough of these where I can just mark them. So like you know, browns for one, blues for one, greens for one. You know what I'm saying? So this is what I say, aspen something. <clears throat> this stencil is delicate. Delicate. Do -do 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 -do. But it's gonna push everything else into the background a little bit. And that's what I want. I want the background to be a background, not the focal. Stay where I want you. Want you to stay. Mm -hmm. Want you to stay. I don't know. Is that a little busy? Let's. Are these like all. Did I just turn that? No, I didn't. Alright. Well, I'm not sure where this is going to end. So I'm just going to keep going down here. Whoops. Would it be weird if I did this sideways on the back? I don't know, decide if I'm going to do it on the back or not. But. This way there's not a big break in where it ends. Almost reminds me of like a wallpaper. That's cool. I like that. Now. I think what I want to do now is line it up. It might not always line up, but when it's closed all the way, as far as it can go, it will line up to some degree. And I'm doing it a little bit more faded here. So, like if I do it stronger, <clears throat> stronger on this side, and fade it out to this side, 
And if it doesn't match up perfectly, you won't notice as much. This is a very delicate, stupid stamp. <laughs> I don't know who's expected to use that. Now, what should I do on the back? I kind of don't want to do that. Could, though. It'll just be, oh, it'll be pretty. We'll do it. That's not right. Well, it would help if I could find the right... That's because that one goes there. Because they're not all exactly the same. That's why. So who knows if I even matched it up right on the other side. Probably not. I'll do a little bit more loosely on the back maybe. This would be more of an aged kind of a deal. Maybe. Isn't that where I just had the... Oh, I see. Because they alternate that way. the right one and am I straight I hope so fingers crossed and like I said I would pause this and not make you have to sit through it just fast forward go back like thir go forward 30 seconds I won't say anything for 30 seconds I said I wouldn't say anything for 30 seconds You're not missing anything. Just fast forward another 20 seconds. Did you fast forward? Because I didn't say anything. You didn't miss anything. You didn't miss anything. Not in a book. Not from I took. Hey, I did watch a girl they took this morning. Showing, I forget what she was showing. She always has pretty stuff though. Always, always, always. Wait, this part, why am I bothered with that? Oh, my hand's so sticky and icky now. <sighs> what do we think? Kind of looks like wallpaper, huh? Well, here's the big question. <laughs> How does it look with this? Well, at least it's going to be brighter when you open it up. I'll give it that. See this screen? That's kind of um, on the edges a lot. I kind of want to bring some of that back in. Um, that's this screen, right? I'm just taking this same green. Oh, I need to figure out where the bottom of this is going to be, don't I? All right. Need. I uh, have a need. Oh, man. You know what really upsets me right now? Is the fact that my rotary cutter is in a box when I was sorting stuff under this pile. I won't be able to get as straight as a line as I want. Um. But it's not going to make sense for me to, all right, we were doing six and a half, right? Huh? Are we sure we want to do six and a half? We're doing six and a half. 
helps if I'm straight. Doesn't help if you're not straight. We're doing it. We're going for slightly smaller. Can anyone see where I just put those slides? This is so, so far. It should be... Sorry about my head, but I made the lines so that I wouldn't see them too much. And now I don't see them at all. Alright, there's one. I guess we're making a new one. Make sure that's straight up there. And then we'll just keep our eye on that one there because we can see this one a little better. And mm, make sure that's lined up there. Wait, I lost it again. Oh, there it is. What about this one? There it is. And we're straight on the edge. There goes nothing, people. I can kind of see that line. I lost it again. Okay, there's. So, what we could do is make a pocket. Should we? Oh. I do have to cut this down a little bit, don't I? Oh, yeah, because I was going to do seven and end up doing six and a half. So, <sighs> do we want a pocket or do we not want a pocket? And I've already folded all that. I have no option. It's got to go this way. I'm really sad about losing that though. But I still need, well, it's going to be double, let's see. Still needs to go all the way down. That's all right. It's all right. All right, I need to come in just a little bit. So our pages, oh shoot, just a little bit means I need the other. Oh my goodness. Hey, wasn't I going to use that little signet thing? It means I need my other cutting board that will cut tiny little sliver edges. Here it is. Oh man. Why? Why do you hate me? Everything hates me. Can't do the other video until I find where everything went. So, I need to just cut off a sliver here. Because I want my... Did anything come off there? I that, that more of a sliver than that. Felt something go through that time, and oh shoot, I don't know how this is gonna work. And this we're doing at six and a half, probably minus a little. might be the time to paint these outside edges right there, huh? Also, I wonder, what do we think? That doesn't even look straight, oh my word. Why? It's not, it's not even straight, oh my word. It moves, that's why. Because I tried doing it from the wrong side, that's why. Oh, lordy, lordy, lord. I think, after all that, I went right on that line. Let's see. If, we're just taking a chance here, seeing if I can cut it with this. I've cut more with it. somewhere and I'm gonna go ahead and glue this so that we'll stay oh wait I needed to see my problem is as soon as I try to do anything in the back it's gonna mess up the front but I do want to get these edges with something oh if I use this it won't be as bad 
There we go. Um, did I ever finish? Oh, no. I cut that so that I could... This is the front. Finish doing these edges. That's why. That's what I was doing. Taking this ink and just kind of doing my edges. The bed, the best is painless. Then, did I do these edges already? I think so. Kind of gives it that kinds of. I'm an adult. I can talk. I'm sure, I can. And then I think, where's my cobalt? I will make less mess if I use my ink rather than paint. So, that's where we're going with that. Let's see if I can get a little bit darker with this. Alright, I've not used this thing before and it's already falling apart. So, sometimes when you buy cheap things, the reason it was cheap, let's see. I don't like doing this with these, but sometimes it's not gonna work. Let's see. What was my color that was close to that? Was this one right? Hello? Hey, hey, Alright, I guess I'm going now. My husband's home. My son might hey, be too. So, in the next video, we will... I should have this sewn together by the next video. And... Might even have my signatures made. So then we can start decorating. But you don't have to see every second of this process because I don't know about you, but that would probably drive me crazy. Well, no, it wouldn't. I like to watch all the processes, actually. So, it wouldn't drive me crazy. Here we go. Let's see what that will look like real quick. That's the wrong one. Gosh, I hope that's the wrong one. Yes, that's the wrong one. Shoot, here it is. It goes like this. I have it upside down right now. So, yeah, there we go. It's going to be that on the inside and that on the outside. And I'm not sure how it's going to. Well, hopefully, once I sew it, and I might need to sew it. I might have to sew it like on the either outside or the inside yeah, here so just to keep this from moving. Because I don't think that I'm going to... I'm not going to glue in here, I don't think. Oh, yeah, I need to um, reinforce this. What in the world? Something just fell off of somewhere. I'll reinforce this, too. Not quite sure how. I might use another piece of canvas. Just so... Let's see. No, I have no idea what I'm going to do. I'll let you know when I'm done. So, have a delightful day, everybody. Did you get to see that? Because apparently I was out of screen there. Yeah, so be... It's not bad. And it's... Once it's sewn in, it will stay where it's supposed to, so... Or I can even do it like that, and that can flap underneath. Either way, it'll hold... I, the point is, I want it to be able to hold things in like a wallet would. Even if it does on the inside and not the outside. Because I think I prefer the outside like that. Oh, you like my big belly? Okay. Have a delightful day, everybody. Much love. Pink.